It is a great fixture with a wonderful history, and the fans are getting to fever pitch. Moments away, and it's live. Great stadium, lovely evening, great to have you with us, welcome. Martin Tyler here, Alan Smith sitting alongside me. Group stage action takes centre stage today. It's Napoli against Maritimo. Well, the fans have certainly turned up for it. Now expecting entertaining contest ahead of them here. It's a real opening and it will put them in front. Oh, they've opened the scoring here. It's a good start, it's a fine start really. has done well to actually get something on that. I didn't think he was going to get a touch. Well, let's take another look at the goal. And that has opened the scoring. 1-0 here. Played down the wing. Keeping the wide attack going. Now they can swing into attack. And he's got some help. Allen. Lozano. Set up to play on the break now. And that shot's blocked very quickly. Well, that's straightforward for the goalkeeper. He's cut that out well, well read. Slipping it through. Alan! People did well to reach it. Great move, great goal. Well, it's a poacher's goal, pure and simple. And this lad has done it time and again during the course of his career. Oh, that's good anticipation. He expected the keeper to parry that, and that's exactly what happened. And you can see a slightly different viewpoint on it restarting at 2-0 well they look promising there in that wide area but the defenders done well here's Fabian Lozano. Milik. Top performance from a top team, and they've emphasised their superiority with the number of goals that they've scored. This contest is over, done and dusted, but the post mortem will be a long and arduous one. Well, the body language at this kickoff isn't great, is it? And you can understand why. Referee played advantage here. So easy in possession. An incisive pass. Towards the near post. Headed back into the middle. Made a quick interception. Well defended, not just getting across, he thought quickly as well. Insignia. Really. It's a good hit. So close. The post. And the ball's in. It's a goal. It's his third goal. It's a hat trick today. He's really been on form. Well, there is a saying that uh, things come in threes. They've come in threes for him, a hat-trick. Not just three goals, but he's played really well. His overall game has been top class today. So off they go again, trying to make some sort of mark in a game that they're being dominated in.
goes out wide again. That's very good defending. They had to get it right, and that defender did it superbly. Here's Mertens. Getting the ball back and thinking attack straight away. They're still going towards goal quickly. Just lost their way at the crucial moment of that counter-attack, and they've lost the ball. Neatly intercepted. But this could be an opportunity, in behind the defence. And the referee looks to his assistant, who's got the flag up, it's offside. Read the play well. Gets the ball out wide with time to assess the situation. Chance for the cross. Can he pick somebody out with his pullback? Brave blocking. They can be quick on the break now. Good vision. Out to a wide man who's got room. The build-up is patient. Looking for goal now. Hit the post. Back into play. Ball away from the opposition, got to keep it now. I think the woodwork's still shaking, Martin, from that effort a few seconds ago. Well, that's over the top of the defender and one to chase. Merton! Well, he's hit it hard, too hard, maybe. Yeah, I don't think he's playing with as much confidence as he would like at the moment. Well, look at the room in which to attack. The goal is there for the taking. Oh, that's what we've come to see. That's a brilliant goal. Well, he's not far out, but you've got to be on your toes in these circumstances, and he was. Well, it was a gift. Strikers dream about moments like this. A tap-in. Yes, yeah, not often that you do get what is literally an open goal. He wasn't going to miss it. So we restart again. 4-1. They can spread the play now. And he's confident with the ball at his feet, isn't he? Shipley! Plenty of power, but not too much direction. He's had a good look and decided on what he's seen from this uh, period of play to add on three minutes. Well, they're getting the ball forward. They need to do that. Cleared the ball. It's half-time here. really was a very one-sided first half and the team on the wrong end of that scoreline has got to show a bit of backbone now. On the move and able to cut out the pass. There was a chance for a better through ball there and that would be the keeper's. I think the wide man's got a chance here. There's space out near the touchline. He's got a chance to cross. That's cut out. He fancies his chances. Real opening now. Well, he's tried to chip the goalkeeper here. Pretty all day. The keeper's given the ball away. Milik. A turnover in play here with that interception. Real chance. That's not what he wanted to do. A poor pass. Takes the shot on. Now oh, the keeper's done well to keep that one out. Alan McAnally at the Udinese game, and he's got news of a goal. It's a goal for Eintracht Frankfurt. 
58 minutes played, 1-1. Thanks, Alan. Trying to spot a potential ball to open them up, but they're keeping the ball well. Off the keeper, back into play. Alan, opening them up with a through pass. Insigne. A real chance here. He's refused to be beaten here. Well, standing ovation from the fans, and why not? What a stop. Well, at this rate, we could be in double figures. Continue to create chances at a fantastic rate. Those strikers, I'm sure, have never had so many opportunities. Milik. Merton. And the referee looks to his assistant, who's got the flag up, it's offside. There's some movement in the dugout. Going to get a change here. Well, now they've got the ball, what are they going to do with it? Got his angles wrong with the pass. Just a quick check on the clock, and there are 20 minutes to go. Now, can he take them on? Put in from the wide area. Well, they've got to keep the crosses coming in. I'm sure in the end we'll deliver something, but it didn't this time. Guiding the pass through. Very much in free kick territory. His foul. Well, Alan, it is the substitution now. Pleasure to be here to see it, Martin. And uh, he'll be grabbing that match ball. Has a go here. Well, he has gone for goal, but you wouldn't really know it. Look at it again. Well, well away from the target. No, he won't want to see that one back later tonight. Just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Time for the defender to clear the cross. Oh, an important interception, that. He's seen the shot. Oh, what a happy goal scorer. He's found the way past the keeper once already, and now he's knocked in his second. And the hat-trick is definitely on for him. Plenty of goals for the fans here. 4-2. Off we go again. And there's the interception. Incisive pass. One on one with the keeper. He's gone too early. He's offside. Singer and then broke down. Kulinski able to intercept here. Excellent play. A couple of options for him from the free kick, whether to go for goal or put it to where his teammates are lining up. The referee doesn't get to look at it again, but we can. That foul. Well, he saw the ball and he thought he could win it. I mean, it always looks worse in slow motion, doesn't it? But he was just a fraction off there. I think that's a decent save from the goalkeeper. Corner swung in. Tried to keep it down, but couldn't quite manage it. Oh, I thought he was going to score there. I thought he should have scored. Correa. Trying to get behind the defenders to get in a good cross. He's left one behind. Teammates arriving for the cutback here. They scored! Well, he's only been on the pitch a matter of minutes. I'm not sure he's touched the ball before this, but a vital touch there to score. Well, it was a gift. Strikers dream about moments like this. A tap-in. Yes, yeah, not often that you do get 
what is literally an open goal, and he wasn't going to miss it. Well, the defending hasn't been too good, you have to say that, but the attacking play has been splendid. That's a silly tackle, really. Well, decisive refereeing here. He reached for the card straight away at that offence. Well, you could argue he's been a bit harsh there. Maybe uh, another ref would have just had a word instead of booking him. They pressed well, and now they might be in. And the referee has now called the halt.